The Sun and His Mother There once lived a son and his mother. The son did many bad things, but the mother never punished him. Today is the son's first day at school. I'm home, Mom. How was school, my son? It was okay. Did you make any friends? No. Then what did you do at school? Nothing much. Can I go to my room now? Wait a minute. What are you hiding behind your back? It's nothing. <laughs> what is it? Just show it to me. I won't punish you. You promise? Yes, I promise. Then here, it's a toy car. Where did you get it? Well, um... It's all right. Just tell me. I won't punish you. A friend gave it to me. A friend? You said you don't have any friends. Well, um... It's all right. Just tell me the truth. I won't punish you. You really won't punish me? Of course not. Well, to tell the truth, I stole it. Oh, really? That's all right. Go ahead and play with it. Thanks, Mom. You're the best. A few days later, the son brought home a storybook. I'm home, Mom. Did you have a good day, my son? Yes, look what I have. What is it? It's a storybook. Where did you get it? Promise not to punish me? Just tell me. I won't punish you. Well, I stole it. It's new, too. Let me see. It really is new. It's all right. Go ahead and read it. Thanks, Mom. You're the best. <laughs> the son kept stealing things, but the mother never punished him. He is now in high school, but his bad habit was still the same. I'm home, Mom. Look what I stole today. What did you steal this time, my son? I stole this jacket. Isn't it nice? Yes, it is. Go ahead and wear it. Thanks, Mom. You're the best. What should I steal next time? I don't care. Whatever you wish, my son. Time passed and the son is now a grown man. He continued to steal things from other people and became a real thief. Where should I go to steal today? I know. I'll go to the bank. There must be lots of money there. The sun breaks into the bank during the night. Wow! Look at all of this money. I'm rich now. Just then, a siren rings and all of the lights in the bank turn on. It is bright as day. The sun tries to run away. Stop there, you thief! You can't get away! The police are everywhere! You are trapped! Ha ha ha! I got you! Let me go! 
just this once. Please, I won't do it again. Not a chance. I can't let you go. You must be punished. Let's go to the police station. The guard takes him to the police station. The son is locked up. His mother comes to visit him. Are you okay, my son? No, I am not okay. I am in jail. <laughs> Why did you do this? Come here closer, Mom. I'll tell you. The mother goes closer to her son. Just then, the son bites her right ear. Ouch! That hurt! Why did you do that? You are a bad boy. You should be punished. <laughs> Why didn't you punish me before? Because of you, I became a thief. What do you mean, my son? I didn't do anything. That's just it. You didn't do anything. You never punished me, and now I'm in jail. Why didn't you punish me when I first stole the toy car? Because I loved you. I'm sorry, my son. It's no use now. Moral. Spare the rod and spoil the child. The Farmer and the Eagle The farmer is a very jolly and kind man. He is also diligent. He wakes up early every morning and goes to work smiling. Hmm, the air is so fresh this morning, and the sun is also so bright, it's a beautiful day. Look at those birds and flowers. I feel so happy. The farmer always sings while he works in his field. La 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 I'm finished for today. I better go home now. On his way home, the farmer hears a strange sound. What is that sound? It sounds like a bird's cry. It must be in danger. I must go and help. The farmer follows the cry. Where is that cry coming from? Over here, sir. Please come quickly. Please help me. I am trapped. There you are. I found you at last. Poor bird. Are you okay? Please wait. I will get you out. Oh, no. Please hurry. My wings hurt. The farmer tries his best. He cuts the net with his knife. I'm almost done. There you are. The net is cut. You are free now. Fly away! The eagle is free from the net, but he doesn't fly away. He is injured. Oh, I 
can't move. My wings hurt. <laughs> Don't cry. What's the matter, Eagle? Are you hurt? Oh, your wings. Don't worry. I'll take care of you. You will fly again. Oh, no. Really? I can't believe it. You're not going to eat me? The farmer takes the eagle to his house. He takes good care of the eagle. You are getting better every day. You'll be able to fly soon. Eat this. It's very delicious. <laughs> you are a kind man. I will never forget your kindness. The eagle is almost well, but the farmer's neighbors hear about the eagle and tell the farmer to sell it. I hear you have an eagle. Why, yes. How did you know? What are you going to do with it? Let it go, of course. You must be kidding. Eagle meat is good medicine. You should eat it. No, no, no. Don't do that. Eagles are worth a lot of money. You should sell it and get a good price. That's right. Thanks for the advice, but I'm going to let it go. He must be crazy. The neighbors can't understand the farmer. They leave the house. A few days later, the eagle's wings are cured. Okay, eagle. Flap your wings. Try to fly a little. Yes, that's it. Very good. Now you can fly again. No, my wings don't hurt anymore. I can really fly again. Thank you, farmer. The eagle flies away. Look at it fly. What a beautiful bird. Weeks pass and the farmer forgets about the eagle. The farmer is tired today and decides to take a nap. He lies down on the grass next to a big high wall. The eagle sees the farmer. Get up, farmer! Quickly! The eagle flaps his wings hard. The farmer hears it and wakes up. Oh, hello there, eagle. How have you been? Are your wings okay? But you look worried. What's wrong? I must warn him. What can I do? I know. Then suddenly, the eagle snatches the farmer's hat. Hey, give it back. What are you doing? Come back. Uh, he's following me. That's good. It's safe over there. I'll drop the hat there. The eagle drops the farmer's hat far away from the wall. The farmer picks it up. Naughty eagle! Why did you do that? Suddenly, the old wall tumbles down. Oh my goodness! Look at that! I could have been hurt! 
Now I understand. Thanks, Eagle. You saved my life. You are the king of all birds. Goodbye. Moral. If you are kind to someone, he will someday repay you. Yeah.